Hello, hello, and welcome back to another episode of Stacy's Kitchen. Today, I will be cooking ackee and saltfish with dumpling and banana. I bought this ackee at the store. This is the brand I use. It's not, it's not bad, guys. I bought it at the Jamaican store. Um, it's not bad. I have my coconut oil right here you all know it you can get it at bj's um also you can get this at fine fair supermarket or um gray supermarket at boston road i have my scallion my onion and my little wear pepper i'm into wear pepper now because it has flavor um so guys I have something to share with you guys hmm. so y'all know my nice black and silver um, stove over here that I prepare all these wonderful meal on okay guys so I have something to show you guys what the, the enemy has done to my stove Okay, so I was boiling the, the codfish. Um, I was boiling the codfish. I stepped away for two minutes and this is what happened. It boiled over. I think the stove get a little bit jealous because he, she know already what is about to take place. So I think she get a little bit jealous and she did all of that to me. So now I have to clean up all of that mess. Also, let me show you what the enemy has done. Look at this. Look at this, guys. This is all shattered. My glass on my stove is all broken. Yes. See that? It's broken all over. All of this you see is, is broken glass. So, the enemy break my stove. So now, I have to go find money. Only one burner working. So now I have to go find money to buy a brand new stove over again. After my stove is just one year old. Like, talk it truth now. I have to go buy some. But anyway, I'm not quarrel with him. I'm not fuss because who oh God bless no one curse. And sometimes in life, when you are trying to do something, you are going to have all of these hurdles in the way. All of these. I will come and more I will come to but you just have to keep the focus and know that all of these hurdles that is in the way is for a reason and you, all you got to keep the focus and do is just get over them the moment you get over them there is nothing more behind it and I know this is one of the hurdles that the enemy is trying and that don't even shake me so I am not getting a uh, black and silver again I am getting a full black girl and I think that's why all this time she never do all of that mess and I think that's why she do all of that mess because she know about the black girl we are cool. so anyway after that we will see one new girl. Me no want no more glass tap. No way. Me no want. Me sorry say me can't make up wood fire in a farin. Because if me could have home, if me did have just have a backyard. Me say if me did, uh, because my backyard concrete and which part me live, me can't have that yet. We call police for me too. Because it's a backyard with driveway. I say me can't go. I make pave. It concrete. So there is no way we can go and they go make up big old wood fire around this. So then we, people we call for me. So anyway, we wish if we did have one of them big backyard where we could have a big one wall and make one fire pit and haul on me pack them. I don't care if we pack them one black mist cover them and right them would have cooked my food and make me see where they go mash up. Right there, I would have cooked my food because me, this a girl, I die out of Jamaicans. Not, not change about her living in a foreign. So, yes, guys, that's what I want to share with you and tell you about my stove where the enemy broke my stove and caused me to go buy another one. 
So, all right, so we're all cooked now. So I'm gonna stay tuned. Okay, guys, so this is my codfish. I boil it and put it in pieces, and then now I put it in some water to just, you know, stay there. And, um, and then I'm gonna cut up these vegetables and get my pot ready to fry. So let me show you. This is my aki. Um, so for me, I always pour, pour it out of the tin into a strainer, strain that water out, rinse it underneath the pipe, and then I get put on a pot with boiling water and salt. And then I re-boil it for like one minute. Just let the water boil up over it to get that can taste off. A lot of people um, cook ackee from the can and they said that it tastes like the can so they don't like it. This is the best way to do it so you don't taste that can. It's strain it off, that water, rinse it. Just put the strainer and let the water run through it with the ackee. And then you put on a little bit of salt water on the fire and just let it boil for one minute. Just let the water boil and pour it in there. And then you could, for one minute, and then you take it out back because it's already cooked. And then you could fry it up after. So this is what I always, always do. And I don't have an issue with my can aki because I always do this to make sure I get rid of that can taste off it. So stay tuned for the rest of it. Okay guys, so now we're gonna fry up our aki after boiling it for one minute. All right, for me, when I'm frying my aki, I don't like tomatoes in my aki because it changes the taste. I don't know how people put tomatoes in aki, but that's their preference. I only put onions and scallion and pepper. And I always make my onions um, brown. I car um like this caramel color yes I try to do it this color and then I had in my codfish because the reason for that is that let me have my codfish too. the reason for that is that it gives give it when the onion and the celery get brown like that it give it a little bit of flavor Yes, it does. Try it and you will see. If you put it in there when the onion is white, it, it doesn't do much. But if you put it in when the onion is brown like that, with the celery, trust and believe you, you get a flavor from it. Um, so I do it like that and then I'll add my ackee in. I don't want to throw it away my eyes. Uh, yes. I don't want to make no mess either. Okay. So I add my, my aki in as well. I'm going to put a little bit more black pepper on it. And I take all of it when it mashed too much, so I take my time and stir as slow. To get everybody in and then that's it I leave it here for like a minute and it's good to go this is my acne size and it's salty this is my salty that's it Okay. It's really good. Trust me, try it with the with the onions and the thing there like that and you will see. And try boiling it after you take it from the can and you will see your can aki is really good. So yes guys. So stay tuned for the, the other part of it, the finishing product. Okay guys, we are done for this evening make up my ackee and salt fish and i'm having it with dumplings um this is the finished product i'm gonna give you a close-up video 
just to say the tomato only there as decoration nothing more it's not going in my aki i'm not gonna eat it maybe Mel's man we eat it but not me i'm not interested in like in the tomato but this is the um finished product of it banana yellow yam and dumpling i'm gonna give you a close-up video of it also so you could see closely um like share subscribe and always remember to put god first guys i'm tired i'm really tired honestly i work today always remember to put god first and i'm gonna have dinner now take a shower and head for my bed um i'm gonna show you a close-up video of this one so remember to like share and subscribe to my channel leave a comment whatever you want to see let me know and when my new stove is here you guys i will also show you guys when it gets here um you tell me if you like this one better here because i try to do black and silver because all my appliance is black and silver so I try to do black and silver, but I think the black will still fit in there. You could also comment about that. Tell me which one then you like. If you want to like the black one when it comes or you like the black and silver, whichever one. So until next time, stay tuned. I'm going to give you the close-up video of my Aki and Salvish and banana and dumpling. Um, remember, I am open for comment. Leave it there. Whatever you want to see, leave the comment there and I will definitely do the video. So, bye. And... Okay, guys, this is my Aki and Saltfish and Yellow Yam Banana. The tomato is only there for decoration. No tomato in my hockey around here okay i want to enjoy my ackee and salvage not eating sour tomato because it changed the flavor okay guys so this is it dinner is ready <laughs>